start with a power 3 ball stretch out into overpower to find the tip of the ball guideline to be just by the right side of the bunker and it is important to start with a power 3 ball because we do want them to release and we're then gonna jump back. Then you can decide do you want to play with a wind 4 or with a wind 5 ball because you're swapping to a p4 win 5 side spin 3 or p4 win 4 side spin 3 I've dropped with both of the balls here the benefit obviously from a win 5 is that you're going to have on the second shot less range to pull but the benefit with a win 4 is that you're going to have an even slower needle of T when we're going max or P we're adjusting max plus 10 P3 numbers and we're using in this case 6.2 top spin and 0.8 left spin. A POC 5 is pushing up 0.3 rings after the adjustment to compensate for the lesser top spin. On this hole, the drive distance is crucial. You need to get up to 415 or better. Sorry, not 415, 412 to 422 is my judgment to be correct. If you do drive longer than 422, I would strongly advise you to go down and play only two and a half bar of right spin uh, on the second shot. This is a big boy option, option number one, and where I call it big boy option as we are going to play with B52.7 or better on the approach. On the second shot, we're going to use all the right spin that we do have and two back spin. Now, zoom in as much as you can so you get underneath the tree there, and you can find the tip of the ball guideline to be one green square short of the hole, pointing towards the hole. Very important, like that. Now, we're going to make two pulls over bullseye, and we're going to use a base of plus 10. So plus 10 is going to be 100% slider plus 25% elevation. P, um, P4 numbers. This is the angle with no tweaks here. If we do have angle more left, we're gonna tweak and obviously more right as well. All will be listed in the guide. Adjustment is made and then we're gonna center the ball and hit perfect. Once again, as said from the beginning, I've dropped this shot with a win four and with a win five ball. So you don't have to spend or focus on this is the only ball to be able to play. But obviously with less wind on the second shot, you're gonna have you're gonna pull less rings, which obviously gonna be helpful. This is a shot for only B52 7 plus because the grizzly will go in between clubs, therefore, we will be having an option number two, which is gonna be slightly different. So, this is option number one, very good chance for a drop, in my opinion. Get our guide on patreon.com slash golf clash Tommy scan the QR code and go directly and sign up.